So now, uh, knowing what is the balance is not so easy. But what is easy is to know what are the extremes. And then we can avoid the extreme. Then we can say somewhere in between the two, the balance would be there. So in general, uh, if we are driving on a road, if there are road markers, then we can know, okay, I'm in my lane or I'm going out of my lane. So whether we are on our lane may not be so easy to know. But if there, there, are, ro there are road markers or ro some kind of road bumps, then as soon as we go on the extremes, go on those road bumps, hey, we start, let's start some kind of jarring sound comes up. We start jolting and bumping. Oh, I've gone off. Now. So what happens like that? We can know the extremes. And then by that, we can infer the balance. So what are the extremes? Speaking the truth without compassion. That is hard-hearted. And having compassion without truth, that is empty-headed. So both these are extremes. Speaking the truth means in the previous context, caring for people's future. Compassion means caring for people's feelings. So both are required. If the both are not there, then we are most likely to be ineffective. So let's look at this from a quadrant perspective, the content of speech and the consequence of speech. So either we speak truth or not truth, that's on the x-axis and the y-axis is whether we have compassion and whether we don't have compassion. Now by compassion, I'm not talking about a philosophical conception of con compassion. That people are in bodily conception and we are giving them uh, the knowledge of spiritual life. I'm talking about compassion in terms of here, in terms of sensitivity to people's emotions, uh, being aware that people are hurting and ensuring that we hurt them the least. So the best is when the speech is kind-hearted and level-headed. Then it is most likely to be effective. So there is truth and there is compassion both. Now, <clears throat> if there is only truth but no compassion, then that is, we may be logically correct, but we won't be psychologically correct. That means we, our, uh, our effect will not, our speech will not have the desired effect. Now, on the other hand, if there is neither truth nor compassion, then it will be, it can be worthless or it may even be destructive. Like when we gossip or when we do rumor mongering, that is unhealthy speech. And then I would say the last left bottom is the most unhealthy. If we are compassionate, but without being truthful, then that's empty headed. And nowadays political correctness can go towards extremes where we are so sensitive that we don't even ever speak the truth. 